story of Dirty Mr. Noon and the exploding golf balls. Dirty Mr. Noon, it was a lovely Saturday morning and it was so sunny, the sun was shining and they got up really early and they had some breakfast of bacon and eggs. And Mr. Noon said, you know what we haven't done for a while? Mr. Noon said, what? We haven't been to play golf. Does anyone know what golf is? Yes. And then he said, you're right, let's go play mini golf. Mini golf. So they drove down to the mini golf range and they said to the lady, and the lady looked very strange. They said to the lady, we'll have two golf clubs and a, some balls, please. And the lady looked very odd. She was sort of a bit furry in the face and had a funny looking eyes <gasps> and a funny hat on. And she said, yes, of course, of dears. She handed them some balls. There's a few balls. Take as many as you like. Here's your clubs. Daddy said, oh, fantastic. Thank you so much. He said, that would be $16. And off they went to the first, they teed off, and Daddy took a swing at the ball, but he missed it. Huh. And he took another swing at the ball, but he missed it again. Mm. Then he swung again, and the ball exploded! Mm. Boom! Daddy fell on his bum. Mr. Nuna was blown f f right across the, the putting green and fell in the water. Splash! <laughs> Daddy got up, his face was all black, <laughs> covered in black soot and smoke. See, what the hell blazes was that? Mr. Noonan said, I don't know, something exploded. Oh, my ball's gone. Lucky that lady gave us a, a couple of balls. Here you have a go, Mr. Noonan, while I wipe this stuff off my face. So Mr. Noonan put his ball down. And he took a swing at it. And missed! <laughs> and he took another swing at it. And missed so badly that he tripped and fell on his bum. <laughs> he picked himself up, lined it up carefully, aimed very carefully at the ball, and hit the ball and... Boom! There was another big explosion. <laughs> this time, Mr. Noonan's place was black and he was flat on his back. Daddy was flung right across the other side of the thing into a, a, a pretend pirate ship. <laughs> Daddy came running back over, picked Mr. Noonan up and said, Are you okay? Mr. Noonan said, I think so. Where are all these explosions coming from? Does anyone know where they might be coming from? The balls. The balls? Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. Okay, well, he said, well, My ball's gone too. Well, lucky that lady, funny-looking lady, gave us lots of uh, balls. So we'll try again, okay? This time we'll go together. So they both put their balls down, took careful aim at the same time, and both swung, and both hit their balls. They exploded. They exploded again this time. It was twice as powerful, and they went flying above the roof, through the roof. They broke through the roof and landed on the counter in front of the funny-looking lady. This time, the funny-looking lady was licking a saucer of milk. <laughs> what kind of creature licks a saucer of milk? A cat! With a magic cat before he got, before he got taken by mm, the guy. Wow. They said, excuse us, there's lots of explosions going on down at the, uh, down at the green. She goes, oh, don't worry. Um, um, uh, they're just, just um, uh, natural gases coming up from underneath the ground, and sometimes they explode. Nothing too dangerous. Tony said, nothing too dangerous. It just knocked us into the air. We just came through the roof. Oh, don't worry about it. Here, take some more balls and go out and keep playing. Daddy and Mr. Noonan got a bit suspicious by this time. And they said, I've got an idea. So they went out. And Daddy said, look, I've got one of my golf balls in my pocket. Let's play with this for now. And he started going, oh, look, there we go. He knocked the ball into the hole. Yay, hole in one. And the funny looking lady was looking out the window with a strange expression on her face. Then Mr. Noonan had a go with Daddy's ball. Oh, there we go. Hole in one for me too. Yay! And then they kept playing another hole. They hit the ball, banged it around a few times. No, no explosions because it wasn't one of their balls, right? So the lady comes running up. She goes, what's going on? What's going on? Let me have a go with those. And she hit the ball herself. But this time it was one of her balls. And what do you think happened? It exploded. And this time it blew her disguise off blew her dress off and her hat and her fake wig and then they saw who it was. Magic cat. It's you! The magic cat! She said, ah! Curses! I got away from that leprechaun after four months! I came back to get even with you guys! Daddy quickly put a bag over the, the magic cat's head and said, that's the end of you. They stuffed her in a locker with all the exploding balls and then they bashed the outside of it until they exploded.
Until what exploded? Until because he, they put the magic cat into a locker yep. with all her exploding balls, yep. and they closed it and they bashed it until all the balls exploded. The cat exploded with them. Wow, well, that's what they think. And they opened it up again, and she was gone. The magic cat was gone. Mm, Probably that of the tricky explosion. cat. That tricky cat. You never know. Maybe he was gone for good, or maybe he magically made himself disappear and got away. And anyway, that's the story of Daddy Mr. Noonan and the Magic Balls. Did everyone like that one? Yeah.